Hi, I'm Brittany Mangold and I'm here at the MU Ballroom where this OSU Blood Drive is underway and it's sponsored by the Blood Drive Association here on campus. And right now it's Monday, but the blood drive goes through Thursday and it starts at 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. every day. So I'm here now with Miss Oregon, Caroline McGowan, who is a current OSU student, but just taking a break to fulfill her duties. So Caroline, what brought you here to the OSU campus blood drive today? Well, I am the official spokesperson for the American Red Cross this year, and so I've been working with the Red Cross all year, and they invited me to come out today, and how can I not support my favorite campus? Well, what my job is, is just to go and talk to people, let them know that we're really thankful for their donation, and sometimes people just need an extra person to talk to, make them feel comfortable, that's what's most important. I'm here with Grant Huber, senior at OSU, and the interesting thing about Grant is that he is a blood drive veteran because he's donated blood 20 times. So Grant, what keeps you coming back to donate? Um, I enjoy donating because it helps other people and my day is just going rough. It always makes me feel better to know that I'm helping somebody else. So Kelly, just tell us a little bit about the importance and significance of this blood drive that OSU has each term. Well, Oregon State has a blood drive every term, so fall, winter, spring, and summer. And the blood drives here are the largest in the Pacific Northwest, so we bring in a lot of blood supply, which is just fantastic because there's always a constant need. This is Rebecca, a junior in ge zoology, who actually helped me out earlier today when I donated blood. Um, so Rebecca, tell me, why did you decide to come down and volunteer today? Well, since I can't donate blood because I'm low in iron, I thought that volunteering here would be a good way to help out with the Red Cross. And yeah, because I've always wanted to donate blood, but since I can't, I found out that you can volunteer here, and so I thought that was a good way to help I was, doing, I was escorting you, and that means that I just help you out if you're feeling a little warm. I can give you like a wet towel or something like that, and then when you're all done, I just I take you to the room where there's a bunch of food and stuff, make sure you don't faint on the way or something like that. And so if you don't want to get invo involved with blood directly, well, not directly, but you know, yeah. being next to the blood like I was, you can go to, there's other ways that you can be, you can help the people get their food afterwards, so. But all I know is, Rebecca, you made me feel 100% more comfortable today donating, so thank you so much. This has been Brittany Mangold reporting live from the OSU Blood Drive at the Memorial Union.